Resetting the overload flag in Torktronix 2 or System 8. When your Torktronix 2 or System 8 is taken to 120% or more of the rated capacity, Failsafe Engineering's 8-step protocol automatically launches. We've added this program to your tester as a way to protect your Torque program integrity. You'll notice the lower LED on the left-hand side of the tester display constantly flashes. That way you'll know Failsafe Engineering has been initiated. If you try and test and calibrate tools between an overload event and resetting the overload flag, you'll notice a couple of things. First, the upper line of the tester display says OV 120%. The lower left-hand corner of the display where you normally see OK or bad, you'll see OV. When you try and erase the overload event, you'll see OV 120% C supervisor on the display. And of course, there's that pesky flashing red LED. Resetting the flag is simple. After you've reset the flag, we highly recommend that you take a good look at the offset to get a sense of whether or not the transducer may have been damaged. When you first power on the tester, the offset is displayed during the third screen of the startup sequence. To reset the overload flag, you'll need to use a terminal program like TerraTerm, EarthTerm, PuTTY, or HyperTerminal. Those programs used to be free with Microsoft Windows XP or programs prior. If you don't have one of those programs, don't worry, we have one for you. Our calibration database, Torque Tool Manager 4, has a terminal program built in, and you can use that. If you don't have the database, don't worry, you can try it for free for 30 days. We don't require a credit card. Just ask us and we'll send you a link and you can download the program. Once you've installed the program, or even if you've been using the software, the first step is to check to ensure that there's communication between the software and the tester. To do that, go to Utilities, and then in the drop-down menu under Utilities, you'll see Test COM port. Click on Test COM port. You'll see two display areas appear in the window that pops up. In the upper window, you'll see the name of the tester appear. Now you know that the tester and the software are communicating. So go back to the Utilities menu item. and In that menu, go to the drop-down and select Terminal. When you do that, you'll see a big black window open. Next, shut off the power to the tester and count to seven. After you reach seven, flip the power switch back on so the tester now has power. You should see the name of the tester and its capacity appear in the top line of the terminal window. So now you're ready to reset the overload flag. Press the D key and press enter. This initiates the diagnostic program. Press the Z key and then press enter. This resets the flag. At this point, the pulsing red LED should stop. Note, for this video, I don't have a unit that's over torqued, so you won't see Z appear on the terminal display. Once the LED stops flashing, press the D key again, press enter. This closes the diagnostic program. Turn off the power, count to seven, and then flip the power switch on the tester back on so the tester has power. The third screen in the startup sequence shows you the offset. It appears briefly, so pay attention. We're looking at the size of the offset. We convert electrical energy into a torque equivalent value. The offset shows that the transducer has been moved from the starting point. If the transducer is moved too far off the center, it may be an indication of damage to that transducer. So how far is off? If your offset is less than 1%, that's normal. If your offset is less than 2%, you may want to check some readings with some tools that you know to be within tolerance to see how close the tester is reading. If the offset is 3% or more, you may want to consider sending the tester into the factory to have it checked out. We can repair or replace the transducer 
as needed. So that's it. That's resetting the overload flag. Remember, checking the offset is critical. We did this to protect the integrity of your torque testing program. Accurate, reliable, durable. Tools you trust from the engineering minds at Sturdivant Richmond. Thank you.